Yeah. I get that feeling in my stomach like I'm feeling for a come up Like a pregnant woman eating for our unborn son or daughter Serial killer with a splash of cold milk These men are built by weight, lactic acid, home skills For the massive more meals, for the gastric hole still Listen, we may clash but the titans don't chill This is food for four, food for you all We ain't the news, just a crew with the tools for the sport Fast food Listening to the fast food podcast. Yeah. The fast food podcast. I'm kind of just. I'm trying to word this right. No. Okay. Okay. White people. When has he ever okay, done okay, that? okay. White people. Yeah. White people are fighting other white people, right. and I'm supposed to give a shit. White people have gone to war with other white people, and is that what you're struggling you, to say? You, you want? Yeah. Do you, are you? Are you? Do you want me to give a shit? You really want me? Who wants you to give a do you want me Who's to... contacting you and saying, "Gee, what the fuck do you think?" About I'm just seeing. Russia I'm just and... seeing. I'm seeing media, just super lit, super no. gassed. Yeah. Everybody's like, "Oh, feel sorry for Ukrainians." But I call Ukrainians. Yeah. It sounds like they sound like like petroleum or it sounds like petroleum or what like Grenadian. Grenadian. <laughs> Most countries have got the E. Yeah, yeah, AM. yeah. That's true, but I'm just like it, the, the, the 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 saturation of <laughs> social media, even in football, even, even in color. even in fucking everywhere. It's like, oh, Ukraine. Let's feel sorry for the Ukrainians. Mm. Rare, rare, rare. I'm like, I'm personally like, Offended. like, why don't like, why should I give a shit about this? Now that, that's just me. I get it. That's so, just that's just. Yeah. That's just, just the way I feel. That's just the way I feel away from this as, microphone. As, as a black man. Yes. <laughs> this is the way I feel as a black man. Is that so that so black so so being black means don't give a fuck about other No, people. but as in you separate your this is me as a like ever like we what's the we compartmentalize different parts of ourselves. Yes. yes. So as a humanitarian, maybe you care. Yes. yes. Right? Yes. But as a black man, as a black man black left man. in the UK dealing with whatever, I've got more important things on my mind. The yeah. motherfuckers fighting each other. It, all right. Let me just get, let me just, let's talk about it. Yeah. Is a war going on outside no one is safe from? That don't matter if you're free feet or eight one. Russia has pretty much just gone in and invaded Ukraine. Yeah. Uh, Putin long and short of it just said yo stay the fuck out of it this yeah. is my this is my thing yeah. i've already warned you lot nato the us don't get involved in this no, shit i believe i believe the uh the, the 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 quote was do not get involved because there will be consequences yeah. which have never been experienced before and i said to myself hey man <laughs> yeah <laughs> i'm not involved i wasn't here yo I'm not here. You may continue. So I just wanted to, because that sent a shiver down my spot. I was like, yo. Because, uh, all right, if the United States was really, really, really uh, cared, they'd have their troops in there right now, right? Helping the Ukrainians out, defending the borders, whatnot and whatnot. But mm -hmm. they, they, they're no way to be seen, but they got bare vim. Now, my thing is, right? My thing is, United States are always involved in conf in, conf in conflicts that don't involve them. They always get involved. When I had a look at the situation, Trim, Joe, Drizzy, and the basically the backstory to it is Putin. He doesn't really want. NATO and United States in any involvement regarding nuclear weapons and he wants to keep their he wants to keep his borders away from everybody else because he has his own uh what would you say own issues with Ukraine and what and their own back and forths and he doesn't want no one involved so for example the way that United States are carrying on is like they ain't even done that before so you can remember Turkey when they were in Turkey and the whole thing with Syria they, they fucking fucked Syria up, basically, and then just dumped all their fucking nuclear weapons in their borders. Putin don't want that. So whether you like Putin or you don't, his, 
His issues are like your mum and dad's issues. You know, like when you're, you know, like when you're young and you're like, and your mum and dad are beefing. Mind your business. Just mind your business. Mind your damn business. Mind your business. This and he's told man not get, to not get involved and stay away from the situation. Now, um, there's a bunch of refugees now that have obviously because the country's been bombed and the whole the whole thing's popping off. They've tried to. They've left. Ukrainians have left and they've gone over to Poland. But you can't call Ukrainians refugees because they're they're from there. They got blonde hair and blue eyes. Well, mm. when you when you when you they can't they, let that let that marinate, please. You got let that marinate. You got a, you got a point there. But what they call, what they're saying is mm. the definition of refugees. <clears throat> it has got nothing to do with your color, has it? No, shouldn't. It, it shouldn't. Right, so you got now you got people that's trying to or get your religion. Yes, you got people trying to get out of Ukraine, and there are black African students who are trying to get away. Not just get, students, but yeah, black, black, blacks. Yeah, there's students over there. Is there, I don't know if there's people who are residents over there who, yeah. t- in terms of they were born in Ukraine, African. But now people. I don't know about that. Maybe now. Is where we start to get mm-hmm. now. Yeah, you see what you're you're, you're bringing to the conversation. Yeah, now mm-hmm. that's when I start to get when I see a mother mm. with her child who's probably not even a year old or is probably under two years trying to get yeah. onto a train and you're pushing her back. Yeah, and then you're kind of pushing her to the side to make someone who is in the exact same situation as her. Yeah. But it's of a lighter skin tone and stuff. Now I care. I don't care in other people's business. Yeah. That's none of my business. Putin yeah. wants to what redo the reason was what USSR war. and all them things and build bridges that go into Russian era. Cool. Yeah. But you're doing this fuckery to people who look just like me. Who before this thing started, you were happy for them to do the little shitty jobs talk it. to get the Ukraine up and running and moving mm-hmm. and do that. The economy. You don't want to yep, do yep. and you know. Yep. Now they're in the same boat as you, scared for their lives and want to leave. Now you're segregating, like, uh, now you're cool to help the economy and do the little shitty jobs or whatever. But right now I need to get us out of here and you lot can fend for yourself. Walk now I care. To the borders, walk to the walk Polish to the border. Walk, walk to the Polish borders with your children and your family and all that. You cannot get on the train. Like, as a human being, like, how long does it take for you to go? This isn't right. Yeah. One lady was said that she was walking for over 12 hours. Crazy. Imagine walking for... The, the man said, oh, don't worry, you can walk. It's about an hour. <laughs> you hear about that? Plus you hear, 11. You hear, did, you see that, did you see that footage of the black, the African brother that said they want to put a weapon in his hand? Yeah, so that he can go and fight yeah. for them. But we can't cross borders, no? But you can. we can fight for you. This is why I'm so conflicted. And the thing about it is, yeah, yeah. again, the way that the... My point is, is that the way that the media, the Western media, put cover these wars and these uh, and these situ- crises, it's like it's very, very hypocritical. Because really, okay, cool. Do I feel for? Do I feel sorry for people that in that are getting bombed in Ukraine? Yes, I do. Yes. I do feel sorry as a humanitarian. I feel sorry for that. But at the same time, if you're gonna feel sorry for Ukraine, you gotta feel sorry for people in Yemen. You gotta feel. Sorry All for people in Libya. Yeah, you gotta were... feel. You gotta feel sorry for people in Afghanistan, Iran, places where the same shit has happened. And but America because doing America, it. America's doing it. Having... All the other places that are getting moved to right now, America's doing it, and I'm not seeing football. Uh, you're not, not seeing see... it in the football stadium. But you're not seeing. seeing oh, like... feel sorry. Oh, it's bad. Oh, let's 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 all come together. Yeah, but the news isn't covering it anyway. There's people that are watching. I've had conversations with people that watch the news profusely and if you have an opinion on something that's not what's in the news, you're a conspiracy theorist. Yeah. Hey, but also because that like, is gospel. Basically, whatever's in the news... Is, is what you're programmed to, to, to actually think you is actually gospel. You actually believe it. Is gospel. Yeah, but what what yeah. difference wow. is Sainsbury's changing the name of Chicken Kiev, how it's spelled, to Chicken Kiev a different way so it's not spelled... How it's spelled in Russia. What difference is that going to make? Yeah. What difference is it going to make to be taking Russian liquor off your shelves? 
What difference? It affects Russia. It's, it's cause and this country has a wet dream about meaningless gestures. Mm. Thank you. I like oh, no, that. No. Thank you. <laughs> For the people at the talking. back, Georgia, can you just say that one more time? <laughs> talk it. This country has a wet dream about giving and performing meaningless gestures. Yeah. And we're just sucking ass all the time. It's especially when, when, as soon as United States get involved, we have to fuck it. Okay, cool. Do you think sanctions are going to do anything to Russia and Putin's? I don't think they care. What sanctions going to do? They are willing to go through whatever. And not only that, but it's not, we're saying... Russians, but it's actually the, the Russian government more so than the actual Russian people because there's Some Russian people that are, that are fully against yeah. it. Yeah. What's think, happening? What they're trying to do is turn the people against the government, but it's a, Russia's an autocracy. Mm. So as much as you want to turn the people against the government, it's, it's almost the same in a way here where everyone... Is against the government, but they almost feel meaningless or yeah. powerless to do anything about it. Yeah, because of the way it's set up. Yeah. The way the system's set up. It's crazy. I just don't like how it's, how they get super vocal as and when they choose to. They turn a blind eye to everything else, but when it's certain things now that seems trendy, all of a sudden, just, they want to get involved. I've what... seen, I'm seeing video clips from random guys, Donnie's, Going to the, do you, is it the Ukraine embassy or something like that? Saying we want to go to war for you guys. What's his name saying? It was the, the Tyson Fury said he's on it. He said he's willing to go and stand next to um, the Klitschko's. Bro, this isn't war. Call of Duty or flipping Let's go. Contra. Him, like his that, dad, bro. his brother. <laughs> let them, let go them, on then. Let them go. All go right. on then. Let them fucking go. Chuck me your belt, bro. Yeah, I'll get your okay. head blown off. But then when all this consistent racist shit is going on, you look like... Yeah, but that he's, it's convenient for him to say whatever he wants. Right, because, because it's, he's it's not the black. hot topic right now. And he's not black. Thank you. There's a side he, of... You can listen to as much reggae as you want. <laughs> <This> <laughs> it doesn't change shit. Yeah. There's a side of me, as a human being, that mm. feels sorry for when <laughs> these things happen to people because there's women, there's children, there's very innocent people mm -hmm. in those countries that are affected by these wars. But on the, on the, on the, on the higher scale... When we're talking about power, structure, systems, yeah. and, 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 and money, mm -hmm. really, yeah, I don't give a fuck. Because you lot love to change the narrative when it's for you lot. Ah, oh, blue-eyed and blonde-haired people are getting killed. What are we doing? But what happened Christians. about... What's, what's, blue-eyed, Christ blonde -haired what's happened? What ha what's happening in Africa when they fucked? These colonizers are just fucking taking a piss. There's not and many blue-eyed, blonde-haired And I don't get... Like, that, like, when the whole thing kicked off, I was like, I need to be super sensitive. But at the same time, I don't give a shit. Fuck that. Okay. And just to wrap it up here, how comes they've always got money to fund wars but not to feed the poor that's a wrap let's that's keep moving that was Tupac. next next topic that was two pack um, next, next topic yeah uh are you done can, can we can we just end it on we don't like war we don't want to see people dying no we are right. There has to be good and bad. We, we, yeah. we, we, we send our condolences yeah. to the yeah. people who yeah, are out there struggling. Can you let can you let some black people on the train, please? Could you let some black people please. on the, tra on the just train? Be, just be human for a few minutes, please. Thank Put your you. agenda to the side and yeah. just be human for a few minutes. I, 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 could you do that? Um, I go by the name of Morgan Heights. Trim Trimmer, who's got the keys to my bimmer. Drizzy, Saka, Fett, Freckles. We are back for a brand new season, season five of the Fast Food Podcast. Remember, it is available on all DSPs, iTunes, Spotify, SoundCloud, and Google Podcasts. Visual episodes are available on our YouTube channel. That is Fast Food Podcast TV. Peace. <laughs> yeah.